intestinal roundworms, the silent killers. Here's Billy Everton. He likes playing football with his dad. He makes straight A's in school. And he likes fine, wholesome entertainment. What's that, Billy? You say your tummy feels like it has butterflies in it. Could it be that cute redhead in third period? No! It's intestinal roundworms! Billy, are you okay, son? Gee golly, Dad! I don't feel very good at all! What's wrong, son? Mr. Everteen, I'm afraid your son has... INTESTINAL ROUNDWORMS! Hi, I'm a doctor. A very important doctor. Why, look at this tie. Roundworms are serious business, and they can, and will, kill you. 25% of the world's population has intestinal roundworms. That is one in every four people. Look to your left, to your right, and in front or behind you. One of these people has intestinal roundworms. Is it you? But doctor, will Billy be okay? No! <laughs> but how does one contract intestinal roundworms? It could have been when you ate that rotting pig. Or it could have been when you ingested that feces infested with larva. I don't know. I'm not a doctor. But once ingested, the eggs hatch in the small intestine. The juveniles penetrate the tissue and enter into the bloodstream. You mean they're in my intestines? No. By now they've migrated to your lungs. Oh. But doctor, is there any way to cure him? Why, yes. Oh, God! <laughs> Isn't there another way? Well, they are sensitive to anesthetics, and, uh, you know, they could migrate from your small intestines out of your nose and mouth. <laughs> <laughs>